Uh, Board of Education Vice President Jackie Long now with us. Jackie, good morning to you. And you must be breathing easier this morning knowing that the levy passed. Well, I got more rest last night. I can put it that way. Yeah, it was, it was, I think it, it was a it was wonderful. I think it, it, I think it showed the county showed um, that the county is in support of um, the board and what's going on. I mean, we have a lot of changes to make and a lot of challenges. As, and as Bill said yesterday, which I well, once I came home, I thought and thought about his advice and yes. We do need to come up with a plan before the state plan, and, um, you know, we're just, we have a lot of challenges, but this board's ready to work and, and get moving. Jackie, I would think, I would argue that your your uh, appearance yesterday on the show helped the levy because you made the point very clear that if we did not get the levy passed, the situation we have in front of us would get even worse. Well, and that uh, that was absolutely positively true. It, I I think if the levy didn't pass, I don't think I know it would have put put this county in a uh, school system in dire straits more than what it is with the situation at North Meadow. And the takeaway well, is that the more transparency there is, the more involved the people are going to feel, and the more supportive they're going to be. Oh yes, and Pat and I both. Bill felt yesterday after we left that it, that was a good hour for us to spend, and we appreciate the time on the air um, just to try to explain somewhat what we felt, what we didn't know, and try to get a grasp of where we're headed. Jackie, I agree with you. I think it was a good hour. I think it's a very productive hour. And also, I want to emphasize, uh, I think you made the point yesterday, you did not really want to come on. You felt the timing was not right. You did not want to come on. So you came on, even though you preferred not to, but I think it was very productive for you, the board, and also the school as a whole that you and Pat were on yesterday. Well, I, and I do definitely feel that I um, that we at first, I didn't want to, but then I, I thought back to our candidacy, candidacy, our candidacy. Well, uh, you can say that running for office. That we we all ran on transparency, and that's what we've always di- have done. And I wanted to continue that. Um, we've always tried to answer the hard questions and to be truthful. And I want to continue that through my term um, and try to make the school system better. Jackie, we have challenges. When does this, this levy kick in that was voted on last night? Um, July 1st. Of 2024? Of this um, year or next year? Um, of next year. Does it ever yeah, really, it, does it ever kick in or does it just not expire? Well, it just doesn't expire. Um, it, um, I've lost my train of thought, but um, if it if it hadn't have passed, then it would have been on the general ba- election ballot. So that was one good thing. But we would have had to go back and make some changes and cuts to make it more appealing to the public. Um, but that would have been hard to do because it was everything in that levy call was what is needed for this county to survive. You know, with your grandfather clock going off in the background, it strikes me that if the levy hadn't passed, this would have been an interesting backdrop to the discussion that we were having. The clock striking nine, right? Well, boom, I'm sorry boom. about that. I enjoy it. Apologize. Yeah, nice you're, you're good. You're good. Uh, Jackie, thank you very much. I appreciate your time this morning. Uh, the incumbents both won last night, Michael Martin and Melissa Power. Do you read anything into that statement right there? I, well, once again, I, I read into it that I think uh, p- the community uh, um, has faith in the board and they want to see us continue um, to do what we've been doing, maybe better, uh, but to be as vocal as we are and uh, to not set back, which we haven't, and speak up and do what's best for this community and these kids and this, the, the employees. And that's what we will continue to do, um, just better. Thank you so much, Jackie. 
Thank you all. Thanks, Jackie. Take Appreciate care. it. Bye-bye. Vice President of the Board of Education, Jackie Long, at 9 o'clock.